731 in the morning time, 731 in the morning time. That is my man DJ My Emotion in the mix right here, 106 KMEL. Now I'm talking to these gentlemen right here who are going to be part of the Red Bull Flute Talk. All right, now, now explain to us a little bit about what this is, man, because we've been playing the commercial for forever, and, and some people have seen it, and some people don't know what the hell it's all about. What is it exactly is going on with the Flute Talk? Well, we don't really know exactly what it is, but we've entered in on it anyway. It's apparently a group of people who have never flown anything in their lives and uh, who are going to be trying out their own crafts and uh, throwing them into the pier, Pier 30, this Saturday at 1. And what can you win if you win this? If you win, if... Wait, hey, if, wait, wait If we win? Wait. Oh, okay, okay. It's, it's not a matter of if we're going to win. When you it's win. It's when we win. What we've built is a structure that is representing the omnipotence of art over science and function. Its name is Mr. Bruce LeBruce because we wanted to name it after a friend. It's about ready to launch in about an hour and a half. And that's about it. It's a situation of action and reaction in which three individuals are going to be kicked in the buttocks and thrown over up here, propelling me into the air. Uh, what that symbolizes is completely up to the individual to interpret it as he or she will. So I have no explanations um, concerning that, and I won't answer any more questions about the metaphor. I mean, perhaps the day is already here when the sluggard intellect of our country will lift from its iron lids, fulfill the postponed expectations. Yeah. Two and two. The postponed expectations of the world was something better than the exertions of mechanical skill. Now here are some of the names of some of the other teams that are going to be competing against you guys. The Nose Diver. Yellow Submarine. Losers. Dr. Strange Bull. Losers. Not in it. The Falling Saucer. That's a great name. The Falling Saucer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Stupid. Okay, the Bat <laughs> Mr. Beefy. Mr. Uh, Beefy. Whoa. Boulders. <laughs> Folly. Yeah. Chew your food. Now, is this going to go down rain or shine on Saturday, you guys? Absolutely. We've been working 12 years on this thing, and no little rain is going to stop me from delivering the goods to all these good people out here in San Francisco. All right. <laughs> Why are you so confident of your win today? Basically, because I think that when people see how present and how, uh, I don't know, much greater art is going to be over science and over function and even over form, that they will acknowledge that we are legitimately the people who should be leading our younger generation into the next century. <laughs> 